Are you hearing sounds in your walls? Bumping? Thumping? Banging? You're probably not dealing with monsters in your walls. You're more than likely dealing with the effects of a phenomenon called water hammer. When you turn on your tap, or your washing machine starts filling, the pressure in your pipes shoots water out and down the system. I know, pretty advanced stuff. But what you might not realize is that when you close the tap or your washing machine stops filling, you're actually creating a shock wave which ripples backwards down the system. This is because water is practically incompressible. So when a pressurized stream is suddenly stopped, it crashes into the tap, creating a sudden spike in pressure which travels backwards down the pipe. This spike in pressure can be pretty extreme depending on the flow rate, causing not only loud banging in your walls, but also damage to your pipes, as well as leakages. But there is a solution. This is a water hammer arrester. This can significantly reduce the effects of water hammer, quieting your pipes and potentially preventing damages. We're gonna set up a demonstration to show you guys the effects of water hammer and what this little device can do to reduce it. Hey guys, so we got a demonstration for the water hammer here. We got about 150 feet of PEX tubing going into the building to a water line. And then we got our pressure gauge here that goes up to 200 PSI. And then we got our valve. So I'm just gonna open it. Pressure goes down. And then when you close it really suddenly, see it shoots back up. All right, we're gonna be installing this water hammer arrester. So we got the water hammer arrester installed uh, and I'm gonna show you the difference right now. So the valve is open, pressure's at zero. And then we close it. To see it doesn't shoot up nearly as far. Welcome back. So when this is open and the water is traveling down the line, there's a lot of energy being carried by the pressurized water. When you close the tap, all of that energy slams right into the tap, creating a pressurized zone which dissipates backwards as a shock wave. So what this water hammer arrestor does is take advantage of the fact that air is much more compressible than water. There's a small watertight piston at the bottom of this tank here. And when hit by the pressure spike, it travels up the tank, compressing the air and softening the shock wave. Well, I hope this demonstration helped you understand the effects of water hammer and what a water hammer resistor can do to help you prevent damages in your pipes. As always, please remember to like and subscribe. And if you like this video, leave a comment. Tell us what you liked about it and what do you want to see from us from the future. Thanks. Have a good one.